Hi, it's Brian Eisenhower, and I'm here to talk to you a little bit today about um, a consistent problem that a lot of real estate agents have uh, with regards to growing their client database, and that is as it pertains to the social, social media channel Facebook. Um, Facebook, uh, we often have lots of friends and we're connected to a lot of people we know on Facebook, but we have a hard time importing or transferring all of those relationships and contacts into our customer relationship manager, our CRM, uh, where we keep our client database. And it's out of a CRM typically we are able to stay in contact uh, with the people we know, uh, with mailers, uh, emails, or even telephone numbers to make phone calls and reach out to them. So um, getting all of those contacts and connections that we've made with Facebook, with our Facebook friends, into our CRM um, is, is the problem because they just can't simply be exp exported and we don't have typically don't have their phone numbers email addresses or home addresses in Facebook so uh, what we recommend is the following method uh, to be able to take all those connections and move them uh, to your uh, client database uh, in a permissive manner too and it's real simple what you do on Facebook you actually use the direct message feature um, so rather than posting it on their timeline or your timeline where the, all the world can see it, you can message them directly and privately. So mess, when you message one person, and typically just go into your friends list and start alphabetically with the letter A, so all your friends like Alan Anderson may come up first, uh, and then we're going to send him a direct message. Uh, the message may be something along the lines of, Hi, it's Brian. I'm updating my real estate database. I'd love to send you something over the holidays or from time to time. My real, real estate business was amazing last year, but I need to do a better job of staying in touch with the people I know. Would you mind replying with your updated home address, phone number, and email address? And once you send that to Alan Anderson, then you're just going to right click on it and copy it. So you copy the entire message, and then you're going to go to the next friend with the letter A and paste it and send it to them. And you're going to work all the way through all of your friends uh, that start with an A. And maybe the next day you start with the B's and get all your friends just pasting, 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 pasting that same direct message uh, to each and every single one of them until you work way through the whole alphabet. And typically that takes an agent, depending on how many friends you have, um, if you've got a thousand friends, that might take you a week or two. If you've got five thousand friends on Facebook, um, that might take you a lot more. And you want to be a little bit selective, uh, you know, who you message. You kind of want to make sure they're in your local area. Uh, there's someone that's not already in your database. But this is a quick way. Uh, to message every single one of your friends and when they reply to you they actually opt in so they're actually offering their contact information to you which means they expect to be contacted with emails phone uh, phone calls or uh, mailer that type of thing so these are and, and, you, and you're actually contacting them and, and in that message I actually mentioned that I was in real estate twice so this is a touch this is a contact to a member of your database that really warms it up and oftentimes a lot of agents will actually get uh, business just from doing this activity uh, because you're reaching out to a lot of people and reminding them that you're in real estate. Um, so this activity alone can generate business, not, not to mention um, you can grow that business over time. And a typical ratio is, you know, for all the friends you, you passed this message to, you're, you're typically going to get somewhere around a 60 to 70 percent return of your friends that actually reply with this contact information. And as as you get them, you just simply input the contact information, their name, of course, you've already got, with uh, all their contact information into your CRM, and your CRM can grow quickly. If you've got a couple thousand friends, um, there's a really good chance that you can grow your database by over a thousand people. A thousand people that know you, that know who you are, that voluntarily opted in to be in your CRM as well, too. Um, so it's a very effective way and also a lot of people are finding that by using the Facebook app on your phone it's a little bit easier actually than using it on a desktop version um, or a, a personal computer um, because the, the um, your friends are actually alphabetized when you uh, search your friends list so you can actually work through the A's, B's, D's in order systematically touching every single Facebook friend and um, pasting uh, this message over and over and over and over 
over again until you and then each day you'll see for you know a week or two after each message you'll still be getting replies back depending how often uh, they log in and check Facebook so remember um, systematically transfer your Facebook fans don't let those contacts just sit there and uh, let's ensure that uh, we grow that day's very very quickly and efficiently and make sure everyone opts in as well too and they agree to be uh, they, they agree to receive these uh, contacts from you in the future so thanks again from all of us here at the real estate trainer.com